Oh, folks, out with this bloody horrible weather, let's have a look who's in the log cabin. Oh, what have you been doing, baby? Get out, Merlin. Out. Go on, out you go. Out you go. Get them blinking dogs out. Prime in your picture frames. Prime in your picture frames. There's the picture frames, folks. They had a wooden frame on them, if you remember, so we've got some... Um... Oh, no, that's the matte finish, isn't it? Oh, that is a primer, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, he's up at the door, look. Go. Go away. Hey, baby? They're going to be white gloss when I've finished. Right, white gloss, yep. You've got that here as well, yeah. haven't you? So you're going over them to do them. Yep. Have a guess who's coming round. Oh, he's coming round, is he? Yeah, he's coming round, oh, yeah. Oh, lovely. Lee Van Camp, folks. Yeah. We've just been on the phone to him. We're going to give him an air fryer, one of our old, not old, well, it's a new air fryer. It's the one we had in our second kitchen, which Charlotte and Jimmy had, and we're giving them the XXL. And the reason being is because on a video next week, Kasori have sent us a new one, and we're going to be, he's in the door over there. I'm going to go into Charlotte's kitchen, and I'm going to show you this dog, how he opens the door, get Martin to film him. It's unbelievable what but he does. We've got a new air fryer, which we have, we've got next week, and we're we'll bringing that to you in the review. So keep your eyes out for that one, folks. Come on, let's go, baby. Right, out you go. Look at her working in the little cabin out in the cold weather, Sharon. I've got one in there, I don't know. Yet. You didn't even have the diesel heater on, did you? Do you want me to lock this door? Uh, no, I'll be back to there soon. All right, I'll put the catch through it, look. Yeah. Right, come in. That's what I've done in there. Oh, come on in. Oh, it's horrible. It's that rainy sleet at the moment, folks. The grounds are all soggy. Oh, come on, baby, in we go. The trouble with leaving it out in this weather, Sharon, is the. Um... Well, it's warm in it. Oh, it is warm in here, actually, yeah, you're right. Out. Oh, that's one of her little it's picture still frame. Have another coat. Yeah, but that was gold. Yeah, gold. That was gold. Always believe in your soul. I tell you, you can go oh. to charity shops. I've noticed down the village, you can pick them up outside old frames, fifty p. Yeah. So I like different frames on the wall. So that's what I'm going for, and I'm doing family photos. I like your hair, baby, your bob. Well, I did have it all going under lovely, but I nodded off on the sofa this morning. She was dribbling as well, folks. All down the side that's of her off. mouth. Come on, baby, inside. Good morning, baby. Right, so we just shut that door, folks. And normally he comes along and opens that door. Watch, 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 watch. Come out of the way, come out of the way, Sha. He knows we're there, look. He's opened it. He's opened it, look, he's opened it, Sha. He's opened it. Go on, there you go, go on, there you go. Go on, go on, you little rotter. Well, as you can see, folks, We've had them walls plastered, as we told you before. This one's now been done. And he's already done it, Sharon. And that one, he's already done. Go back out there. Go on, away. Go on. He's pulled the blink curtain thing around there, look. Go on, off you go. Let's go have to lock the door, look. So yeah, we've had this wall done there. We had some damp up on the ceiling there, which we had to take out and that's been replastered. So all this has got to be gutted out and we're, well, you can see what we're doing at the moment, folks. This is another project. Oh God, so just coming down here. Got the old fire going at the moment. Let's give that a bit of a poke. It's really cold out, folks. So by the time you see this video, we'll be uh, up in Scotland. Let's give that a bit of a poke. So we've got that one on. This paraffin heater on, which is the Zebrew one. I've actually just repaired this one on my Retro Restore channel. I had to put a new wick in it because I put some um, kerosene in it with some oil in it and it blocks all the wick up, but I've done a repair video on that on my uh, Retro Restore video. So we're just waiting for Lee Van Camp to come round and we're gonna give him an air fryer. One of our smaller ones, a 3.3 litre, I think it was, or 3.8 litre Kasori. So yeah, that'd be nice for him. So we'll see you in a minute. Ah, right, here we go. Right. Did I hear the doorbell, Sharon? Yeah, you sure did. You can go. I'm busy. I can't hear it. Did I hear the doorbell, Sharon? Did I hear the doorbell, Sharon? Oh, there we go. Yeah, there we go. Unbelievable. Stay. He's worked on cue, Sharon, hasn't he? Oh, I'm tired. I want to go. Oh, my. Yeah. What do you want? What do you want? I got a phone call this morning. Yeah. From a Mr. Butler. Oh, yeah. He said he's got something for me. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, can I come out in the light for a I can't quite see what, yeah. what colour your beard is today. Oh, Who are you today? It's very bushy. What are you done to it? Nothing. Hey? It's just grey. What have you got your glasses on for? It's snowing outside. There's no glasses. <laughs> come on, here you come. There you go, folks. I'll put that light up. Look. Still doing that. Hey? Mark, shut the front door. You're letting the heat in. Yeah, let the heat in. It's cold in here. Look, it's cold. 
It's colder inside than outside. Can you pull the uh, can you pull the curtains over, please? That's, that's good, Sharon. Yeah, can you be on the other side of the curtains? Oh, <laughs> can you pull that's it. You be on the other side of the curtains, yeah, please. Yeah. That's better. Now it now we can talk sense. Yeah. Right, yeah. come out of there, you'll ruin them. Yeah. There's a big bulge in the curtains. Oh hello. Hello. Go on in. What are you gonna do? No, you ain't doing it right. Oh. No, 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 no. Look, look, look. No. That's wrong. No, it's not. Look. That's not comedy. That's comedy. <laughs> can I have a go? Oh, you already have a go. You no, I mean I mean you're that. Ah, <laughs> you love comedy in me, don't you? <laughs> no, I'm gonna do it better than you. You probably will, because hey? you're smaller. Hey? Oh no. Wait, wait there. Come out of the way, look. No, you don't. Oh, stay there, you look. Go you go, there. No, you stay where you are, look, look. Uh, look, look. So you do that, right? Oh yeah. You do that. Oh yeah. Right, like that. Yeah. And you do that. Oh yeah. No, no, no. Oh, what is it? You do like that, yeah? Oh yeah. And you go, hello, and yeah. then you go, like that, you go, like that. And then you come back up. Yeah. That's what I do. Alright. Oh, anyway. You can go now. That would be better, would it? Hey? Did you like it? Was it yeah. more impressive than yours? Might have been. I don't know. Until I look at the rushes. Can I just say something? Until I look at the rushes. The best can I, can I just say something? Shout, can I just say something? Just turn around for a minute. That is perfect. Look, that's perfect. <laughs> yeah. On your last video, you had a bit of 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 the van, no, he was no, stayed no. in the van overnight. Oh, because I, I didn't... You, it, it was like that. It was, I didn't brush it. You turned your head sideways to look over and that's you had a great the, big line. That's what Dale said. <laughs> Terrible state he, he was in, he, folks. He woke up with more air. Yeah. Well, it, 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 there, it was a big, big line. And I loved it when you kept turning your head, because all I could focus on I was that line. I didn't see that. Hey? Oh. Well, there you go. I what I tell you. Anyway, I've got something for you. What you got for me? <sighs> Wait Is there. Is it a six-foot blonde? Wait there. Let's go and get it. Is it a six-foot blonde? Hold on. Oh, come this way. Oh, is that what I've got? Hey? Is that, is that my present? <laughs> oh, go on that side. Ladies, always on that side. This is where me and Sharon do our food videos. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Well, hang uh, on. Hey? I'm Sharon. Oh, you're getting clout in a minute, I'm telling you. She's got you. a better haircut than you. Yeah, what we do it... That's what, not a bob. What we do it today, uh, Martin? Hey? What we, get off me bum. Oh, hey? It's a dog. <laughs> Right, what we do it today. See that? Yeah. That's what we sit around to keep warm. You've just blown it out. I know, I know. I'm, I'm doing it, Cal. I'm, I'm doing comedy, Sharon. Sharon, you mustn't let them know that. When, when it's really cold, we yeah. sit around that to keep warm. Well, I would as well. What? No, no, when it's... Sorry, start again. Start again. When, start. It's, when it's cold, yeah. we sit around a candle to keep warm. That's no good. No, when it's really cold, we light it. <laughs> He's funny, isn't he? Oh, it smells lovely. Or oh, is that you? How come you never do this when you're doing your cooking? When there's no comedy What's in What's that cooking? smell? <laughs> it's like cotton. Cotton fab fab fabric. Bed. No, it's a smell. Ooh, it's smell. Fuck don't fuck sin, fuck don't fuck sin, fuck don't fuck sin fuck that. Fuck God. Fuck hey? <laughs> Nylon goes up no, quick, mate, I'll tell you. Sorry, no, this, this is real hair. Is that your coffee? What one was whose? Uh, this is real hair. I think that was yours. Actually, this is real hair. Well, hold on, let me taste it, because you wear lipstick. I'm not going to do it. What's the matter with your arm? Hey? You're going to be all funny. That's mine, that's yours. Yeah, it's real hair. Right, so get that. It's not real hair. It's not synthetic. Stay there right where you are and don't talk because the microphone's on me. I'd like to present oh, no, you. I can talk now. Yeah, you can, of course you can. <laughs> I can I'd like, like, who put a little that, that fire hazard? What's this? I'd like to present you with an air fryer. Oh, yeah. This is a Kasori 3.8 litre. Yeah. Is that the one that catch fire? <laughs> sorry, sorry. Cut. Unbelievable. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> no. That's America, Canada, oh, no. and Mexico. That's, as you say, that's comedy. All right. So we've, we've, it's all been sorted out for you. This was in our second kitchen. Oh, yeah, in your second kitchen. In our kitchen. second kitchen over there that's being restored at the moment. Yeah. So it's simple enough for you. Is it a 3-litre? It's a 3.8-litre, I think. You're joking. Oh, yeah. You've got an extra 0.8-litre. Well, litre. my mum's only got a 2-litre. Wow, this is far superior. I can get two steaks in there. And you can get two. Chips. Sausages, everything you can do in there. Can I put oil in there? What, what would you want to do that for? With the, to, to, to oil my chips. You can squirt oil on it. What oh, I suggest... Yeah, there's one, one kite. Here, folks, look, you, you won't believe this. Our, it's so cold in here, look. That's our olive oil container. It's so cold in here, look. It's bloody solidified, look. Our oil's solidified sure in the kitchen. Not, you sure that's not uh, uh, perfume? Hey? It's not perfume. No. 
So yeah, get one of them. Yeah. But a little tip, I'm the only one on YouTube yeah. that's told people this. Normally these come out and they jet out just in one, we want to spray in one, like a fine oh, mist. Oh yeah, because the one mum Shake got, it up like that, yeah. aerate it and then spray it and it will come out How in a mist. shake it up? Good, yeah, right, okay. Hey? Yeah, my mum's got one and uh, it's from Lidl. I like it. Either. And it just goes... Like they all nozzle, do, like they all nozzle. do. It's the nature of the beast. So you have to put more on? No, you squirt, you just shake it. Yeah. And it will come out more of a spray pan. What, I'm what? the only one who suggested that on YouTube. I've been through the whole of YouTube, all the videos on YouTube. Oh, you're the man. Millions of them. Yeah, that's good. Anything else you've got to tell them? I'm, I'm over the moon with this, I really am. It's only been six years. They've not been out for six years. They have. In America. Yeah. Everything's out in America first. Cheers. Cheers. Right, I'm going now, can I? <laughs> off you go. Take your, take your air fryer, off you go. No, but you'll, no, no. you will like it. Yeah. You'll, you'll, you'll love it. I, what I can do... What you can do, what? When I get my big inverter, yeah. right, I'm going to put it onto my leisure battery yeah. in my camper van. Oh, that'd be nice. Yeah, because it's a 2,500 watt, 5,000 watt peak. Oh, brilliant, because... Will, will this, this, this will plug into it. Yeah, I think this is only 1,500 watts. Oh, well, that's all right, then. I, f I can't remember off the top of my head, but I think that's a 1,500 watts. It's only 2,500 watts, but you have to, it goes on the ampage power. So I've got 110... No, that goes on the wattage. No, no, I'm talking about my inverter. Right. I've got a 110 amp inverter, which means I will get one amp... Not 110 amp. You wouldn't have an 110 amp inverter. 110... I mean, 110 amp battery. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I've got 110 He's amp... He's talking to an ex-electrician here, folks. I've... I know what I'm talking about. I've... Yeah, he does. I've got 110 amp... Um... Inverter, which means I will get a hundred hours at one amp. Yes, or that's right. Fifth or half that with with if if you get um, um, double it up. Double it up. Yeah. Double double your money. Double your money. Double take, or nothing. Double, double, double or quits. Your pick. Double or quits. Yeah, I remember that program. Yeah. Miles. Miles Johnson. No, Miles. Miles and Miles. 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 Ma miles two Davis. miles long. Miles Davis. Miles no, Davis. Miles back. No, Miles. miles. Max, oh, Max he's, Bygraves? He's in the 60s, late 60s. Miles. Miles, Miles, Miles Jeffries? No. Lionel Jeffries? Miles, Lionel Miles. Blair? Tony Blair? No. Who is it? What are you talking about? I can't remember. Have a swig of coffee. Yeah. <sighs> Do you like that? I'll put cream in coffee. Oh, I like whatever. I'm privileged. Take a chance on me. Alright. I believe in angels. <laughs> hey? Do you? Go on, say another one. Uh, I believe in angels. Now I've said that one. Don't oh, copy right. what I say. Say your own Abba song. Oh, okay. Go oh, on. Abba song. Abba song. Waterloo. What? Well, they never sung it like that. <laughs> Waterloo. Waterloo. How do you be if you won yeah. the war? Yeah, the Eurovision Song Contest is coming up. Oh, I don't watch that anymore. You know what? It's not it's the same so as it used to be. It's of course it is. Right, I'll tell you something. There we go. Right. It's, this, this is Lee's prediction. Whatever country at the minute is being downtrodden on, yep. like last year, yep. uh, it was poor old Ukraine, they won. Can right? I just say something? I'm not saying that they, were, they weren't any good. 1974, good. 1974, Great Britain gives no, Sweden... Take that out. I might have all the Ukraine 1974, people. 1974, United Kingdom gives Sweden zero poids for Waterloo. Work that one out. So what you're saying is, it's a bit true, but it's a bit untrue as well. I've just proved it. No, that. you haven't. Because it, no you, no, you ask anybody, they all say it's political. Uh, all right, let's go and ask Sharon. Let's go, all right, let's put that to no, the no, test. No, yeah, Sharon, yeah, no. Sharon no, Sharon's not biased. Sharon's not biased. Who's on the phone, Sharon? Jimmy, all right. Ask Jimmy. Hold on, Sharon. Just pause that volume. All right, can't turn it off. Sharon. What? Or oh, Jimmy. Is the Eurovision Song Contest political? Yeah. Right, Sharon, yeah. your answer. Is it political? Yeah. Thank you! <laughs> well, uh, I love it! I love it when I'm right! Yes! You don't know what to say! For once, you don't know what to say! <laughs> look at his bad knees, folks, look. Yeah, yeah, look. Well, look, look. Hey, hey. Do that again, look like a pe penguin. <laughs> I knew that, folks. You think I don't know that? I'm just putting them to the test. And that's, a, look, that's how easily he's pleased. That's how easy he's pleased, folks. Oh, you've got to tell you, look, he's got to play, play it down. Oh, I am easily pleased. Hey? I am easily pleased. Someone said they like my singing voice. 
I've got the blues. Now stop singing the same songs all the time. So you happy with this? Yeah, thank you. Right, well let's put it away. It'll only cost you, 50, can you just, 54 quid. Can you just... I know you tell everybody on your videos. Right. Do I have to let it warm up first? You're talking about preheating. Preheating, on whatever I cook. I'll be honest with you, we yeah. should probably do when we cook certain things, but we never do. That's what I noticed. Oh, eh? That's what I'm saying, that's what I noticed on your videos. We do that's do it... I wanted to check with you. ...when we're doing cakes or baking. Yeah. For things like sausages, steaks, burgers, chips, all that sort of stuff, we don't really bother. The most... As long as it's cooked and Listen, it's steaming. You'll get loads of people give you, oh, oh, that's got to be 180 degrees, that'll be 200 degrees, that's got to be 140 degrees, 160 degrees. General food like that, which you're reheating or, or heating up from cold, Yeah. we don't tend to put frozen stuff in there right? because it increases the cooking time. And you must keep it away from the wall. <laughs> well, you can do. Well, you know me mum's? That's what I think that bracket's for there. If you look at that bracket there, it keeps it off the wall well, anyway. You know me mum's? Yes. It stopped working. Why is that then? We don't know. She uh, bought one uh, of them cheap ones, didn't she? Well, Dale got it. There you go. It was. It was. It wasn't a, a Momo make. It was a what? A Momo make. Uh, it was a. Uh, was it a tower? Yeah, it was a tower. And uh, they are at the cheap the end. It's not the few. They're about fifty pounds. Then ones they're at the cheap end of the market. Done about four mils. We have a lot of people say about the cheaper ones. You can get them in the supermarkets, but the cooking time takes hell of a lot longer and they don't seem to heat the food up properly. That's not me talking, that's what other I've people have said. I've just seen one, the cheapest I've seen, was a two litre... Too small. Slater, or salter? Salter, 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 yeah. Yeah, guess how much? How much? £28.99. No, that's too cheap. From Robert Dyers. Yeah, who was he then? He's a man who's got a shop. I know he is, he's, he's you a don't chain. see the shops anymore. You have to do it online, I think. Of course think. you do. But no. But I thought that was cheap though, 28 Kasori, uh, now probably one of the mo most famous names. Ninja, as you well know. This, hey. this being a Kasori. Um, again, we've used this, we've cooked in this, we've done a video on this, this actual one, and we, uh, we, we cook some lovely stuff in it. Yeah. But we tend to cook most stuff, most stuff that you reheat or cook from like a pie, pasty, sausage rolls, burgers, chips, all that sort of stuff. 200 degrees, 12 to 15 minutes. Sausages, 200 degrees, 12 minutes. Yeah. When I got that out on my mum's one, oh, yeah. and I immersed it all in water, oh. she came in. Yeah. She said, you can't do that. It says you can't do that. Yeah. I said, mum, you can because this is all integrated. It all integrated? Integrated. Integrated. I've never heard of that before. Right. And she can was I just panicking. Say, yeah, well, your mum's got a point. I know, I, yeah, I tell you, stay there. My mum has got a point. I'll tell you for why. Right. Because, yes, we only ever take that crisper tray out. Yeah. And we put that in soak. Or yeah. leave that in and just put it in soak. That's what i done first you, of all. A lot of people, these are supposed to be dishwasher friendly yeah, where you can right. put the whole thing in. Yeah. But we refrain, I love that word. We? Yeah. <laughs> we refrain from putting this under water because you can get food stuck in there. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. So you wouldn't, that, wouldn't the dishwasher clean it all out? Well, then? it may or it may not do. Right. So we don't bother. We just literally just soak that in some soapy water. Yeah. Give that a wipe out, yeah. that's ready to go back in, because that's a non-stick coating on that. size that is? That's, it's bigger than what you think, it's like the TARDIS. Can you get trays you put in there to stack up yeah. and do like a bit there? And you can do, top. but it's not worth it. You don't want nothing to get above that level. See that mark there, that line? Oh, yeah. You don't want nothing above there because it'll touch the element. Oh. You so don't want to... Basically, it's just like a little heater in there. Well, it's a, it? No, it's not like a little oven. Little oven? It's a little oven. A little oven? It's a little oven. But it gets up more quicker? Yeah, because it's a smaller area. Yeah. But what well, you can I'm, get... I'm going to throw a bit of steak in there. Yeah, what you can get... Yeah. I can't show you this. Look, this is the, this is the new, new kid, Ooh, on, new oh, kid on the block. Oh, look at that. That's the, can't show you that, folks. That's a new kid. We're doing a review on this during the week, as I say. Can't tell you that one. That's the new one we've just been sent to, from, uh, from Kasori. Yeah, yeah. And uh, we've done a review on it already, but they've sent us this one, and we're going to do a whole new lot of review on it for... That's a bit bigger than For this, today's market. That's 6.8 litres, is it? 6.9 litres, I think. Well, you get a lot in there, wouldn't you? Well, it's double the size of that. It's over double the yeah, size. Well, yeah, nearly. Yeah, 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 yeah. What's yeah. this thing here, then? Hey, eh? That's uh, uh, C3PO. Oh, yeah. R2-D2. Oh, does he? He looks like him from this Of course angle. he does. Yeah. That's a Ninja 15-in-1. Right. Anything else you like to know? Uh, yeah, well, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 well, what's my next present going to be? What's the what? My next present going to be. You ain't getting no more presents. You're not, I don't think you're really grateful for that. Oh. What you done there? You fired. No, I went, You went, oh. oh. Yeah, talk about, I've got your mine. 
No. At the thingy bob. Wait till they see that. Oh, on it's my terrible. Channel. Yeah. Oh, I've had to X rate it. Okay, folks, that's enough of him for the moment. <coughs> Let's move on. Let's get to another segment. We'll see you in a minute. Well, out and about in uh, Tesco's again, Sharon, yeah. aren't we? Just having a little look around, we're doing our shopping, our weekly shop. We've got our screen wash up, we might yep. have 10 for going up to Scotland. Yep. And we've got baby Frank again. What you got there, baby Frank? A toy? What you got? Oh, look at that. Nanny, buy that, ain't you, Nanny? Of course. We'll get that Frank. Yeah. Mate here. Oh, what's here? What have we got here? Don't know. Well, yeah, that's good. Yeah. 18 pounds. 18 pounds? What's that reduced for? That's a deep fat yeah, fryer, isn't it? The box is damaged, isn't it? We still use a deep fat fryer, folks, don't we, Sharon? Yeah, you can't put it for chips, can yeah. you? Yeah. And also, we know you can do um, scotch eggs in an air fryer, although we haven't tried it yet, Sharon, have we? No. But we like our deep fried scotch that. eggs. Of course, Easter's coming up now, and as you can see, we're in uh, March at the moment, but as you can see, the supermarkets have embraced Easter, as they always do. And uh, two pound for an Easter egg. I don't suppose that's too bad. Five pound for them ones. There's the bigger one there, but uh, all the famous mates are there. As you can see, we don't have them, so we don't we don't buy into all that anyway. So we just walk past that. Although you do like uh, Lindor chocolate, Sharon. Well, no, you? that's Tracy's favourite. Oh, birthday, Tracy, is it? Isn't it? Yeah, it's her birthday. That's why we're going up to Scotland as well because it's Tracy's birthday, well, Sharon. That's the reason we're going. Yep. Yeah. Now that is one cake that we absolutely love, and we only have it as a treat now, don't we? Yeah. Do you know what? What? Well, it's a treat. We're going oh, to Scotland. Well, we'll eat that on. At, well, we're up in Scotland, but yeah, them folks. I don't know what it is, but I like taking it apart segment by segment, and we both do. We'll eat the top off first, but I do like a cabbage chocolate. That was my dad's favourite. Hey? That was my dad's yeah, favourite. That's mine. how long that's been going, though. Isn't I know it? it's been yeah. about for years. I know that was years and years ago. Just have a quick look at that, folks. We've got some music on over the top of us. Reduced yeah. salt uh, marmite. We do like marmite. I don't know if it will taste any different, but uh, we'll give it a go anyway. worth having a look at the old reduced to clear section Sharon isn't it? Oh, I always look there. Just have a little look there, there's not much there at the moment no but uh, well, always worth. Here by the fish, though. Where? Yeah there's always someone here as well aren't there? Got one in the corner here as well folks. There we go. Don't have as much there. What's that baby? How much are those? Two pounds four. See it's a lot of money isn't it? You can make your own can't you for that money? Fish cakes. Hey how much is that? £3. Down from what? Five. Hmm. Don't know. What do you reckon, baby Frank? Hey, what do you reckon? <laughs> yeah. Now, folks, look. Tesco do this. This was that um, stuff that Sharon had at the uh, station, Kings Cross Station. I think she had the sweet chili chicken one. Look, they actually do it in uh, Tesco's here. Look, four pounds twenty-five. Although I think. She paid more for that, didn't you, Sharon? Eight pounds. You paid eight pounds for it at the station. Yeah. And I think it was the same size box, wasn't it? Yeah. So it's actually cheaper to buy in uh, Tesco's, but you did say it was very nice. I didn't have a microwave on me back to no, me. No, of course you didn't. Yeah. But that's that's how much it cost in. Oh, that's in, the one the, I have, isn't it? Oh, the sweet yeah. chili chicken, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. There we go. Um, very tasty. You can have one. There no one on the show. We've just come across these folks, Charlie Bingham's. Look at the blinking price of these, look. 
That's just for one cottage pie, isn't it? What's the weight of that? That feels quite heavy as well. It's um, supposed to serve two people. You're looking at, um, what's the weight on that, Sharon? I can't see the weight. Turn it upside down. Is it up the bottom, is it? I can't see. Oh, 650 grams in weight there, folks. Nine pound fifty though. It's that quite one's dear. Nine fifty. You got your mash underneath as well. Yeah, they're probably a bit elitist, didn't they? I would have thought. So, uh, but nine pound fifty. It looks a nice thing, I must say. The graphics are done nicely as well. And I don't know that about how about preservatives or whatever, but uh, I don't know that one. what's that one? Chicken satay curry. Yeah. So I've never seen these before. So it's got a big its own sort of display area here. So that's Charlie Bingham's. Let us know if you've had them. See what they taste like. I've never had them before. Coco van. Chili con carne there, Thai green chili as well. Look at that, look. So, yeah, it's probably on par as the takeaway prices. So, uh, yeah, hey, what's that? What's that? A meal deal for a pizza? Yeah, but you get the sides as well one main and two extras for yeah, regular six price pounds. is four pounds. So, for six pounds, you can get a side, which I presume well, is uh, for that. Because, yeah, that'd be two pounds fifty if you buy that on its own, You've wouldn't it? Look, puddings as well in that. There you go. But if you're on your own shell, it's or you can't be bothered to cook. It's ideal for two, isn't it? Yeah. There you go, two of things they've got on offer here. That looks quite nice. That looks quite nice. There's a tandoori mixed grill Indian there. Look at that, look. Well, they've got a the four pounders for cheese there. I can't reach them to show you. I don't know, let's have a look. What's that? At the back there, quarter pounder with cheese here, look. Quarter pounder with cheese. Class that as a main meal here, yeah, would it, Chef? You can't grumble at that, can you, in two yeah. sides? So you've got two burgers there, just the buns and the processed cheese, basically. So, uh, how much is that? Well, with two sides, that's six pounds. So you could have that. That's a good buy. You could have that, uh, any two of these sides here, folks. Chips there, whatever. That's not a bad buy, yeah. Chunky chips. Comparable to a takeaway price, isn't it? These are folks, look, hig higgity pies. I don't think they've got a lid on them, but they've got loads of uh, food on the top of them. Look, they're open open pies. I think they're veggie ones, aren't they? Does that make it a flan if it's got no top on? I don't know. Then you've got the uh, ultimate sausage rolls up here. Look at them, look. Look nice, don't they? There you go. And the ultimate pork pie. Look at that, look. That's a monster, isn't it? £3.70, though, look. A lot of weight in that as well. Very nice. What's that? Feta? Do like a bit of feta in my salad, all crumbled up, Sharon. Nana. Say Nana. 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 We much prefer, Sharon, to do with this tool you got in your hand. What, what's that there? It's a scanner. Yeah, you scan everything on there, and then once you scanned it, it adds up all the prices, and you just put them in your bags. It's actually good if you're on a budget, and it? You won't go and, over. Yeah, you, you know exactly what you're spending all the way around, don't you? Yeah. But also, you, um, you bag your own stuff up, as you're doing now. And you can see exactly how much you're spending, can't you? Yeah. Butter, yeah, we love butter. Yeah. Look at the price of butter, though, folks. Look, two pound fifty. The one I really like, but it's, again, I won't pay this price. Though it's this pure Irish Kerrygold, because I think you'll find it's grass-fed. And yeah, yeah, look, from grass-fed cows, which is a lot better for you. But uh, unfortunately, it's two pound sixty a throw, and that's a hell of a lot of money. What have you got there, baby? Egg whites. I've never yeah, seen they, that before. Yeah, they do that in America a lot. You can buy just the egg whites themselves. I know. I'm in the United Kingdom. I know, but what I'm saying is that it's been out a long time, Sharon. Oh, I've not seen it either. A lot of people who are bodybuilders and all that, when they have high-protein diets, they normally buy the, just the egg whites and have an egg white omelette, Sharon. Lovely. If you like that sort of thing. What about almond milk, baby? So, as you know, we do uh, 
a lot of shopping and uh, we have a lot of food but we do buy a lot of food from supermarkets as you see but um, we don't buy into all the sort of uh, the sweet processed stuff you know all this sort of stuff for example we don't buy any of that that's not on our list but the odd ready meal is fine it's not a problem for quickness and convenience so uh, yeah just use it for what you want someone did ask us where you got that tin of spam from Sharon there it is there folks look that's the one in the easier to open packet that's your normal tin there they're both exactly the same weight apparently and also the same price so if you want the easier to open one they're in uh, Tesco's and just look at them puddings up there Sharon look at them Frey Bentos meat puddings they're 200 gram ones there ones they're about the same size as our ones but uh, I don't think it'll beat yours Sharon I don't think it'll beat Nanny's Frank do I? Don't think it'll beat oh I don't think it'll beat Nanny's. Although you can buy the bigger tin of spam, Sharon. And someone else mentioned, can you put the uh, bacon grill in as well? Yeah, but there's the bacon grill. A lot of, I think the Americans have bacon grill, Sharon, don't they? Mm. So you can get the bacon grill if you want, or even pork luncheon meat, I think that'll do the same thing as spam, it's entirely up to you. And that's actually cheaper, the bacon grill there. Look, that's only one pound fifty, Sharon. Uh, that's pork luncheon meat. No, that's bacon grill. Luncheon, Where does it say that? Oh, I'm looking at that tin there. You're yeah, looking over yeah, there? No, I'm looking there. Yeah, but this is all bacon grill and the luncheon meat's the same price anyway, so. But it's a lot cheaper than the spam. You're paying for the brand name, obviously. What's that stuff there? Look. Chopped pork. I don't know. That's the same sort of thing, but round, isn't it? Yeah. There we go. What are you saying? Hey, are you talking? Frank, you talking to Nanny? Hey, say something to Nanny. Right, we'll leave it there, folks. I think you've seen enough of us do our shopping, and we'll see you when we get home. Bye for now. Right, we're back home now, folks. We're here in the safety of our home, in the warmth. Is it warm? No, it's actually warmer outside, because the sun's out. But I have fixed that fire, Sharon. Yes. And it goes a blinking beauty now, doesn't it? Yeah, you just need one of them in every room. <laughs> of course we do. They're £350 each, Sharon. Yeah. We're doing that. Right, we've got a little super thanks. Could and I a, not, a, Eh? Could I not put one on my wish list? Don't take the mickey out of them, shall No, that's it, I won't, no. Right, what have we got? We've got a little gift there as well, haven't we? Yes, because I like to keep the cupboards a bit more organised now. There you go. Some lovely little cupboard containers there. And who are these from, baby? These are from Ian Holdcroft, so thank you very much. Thank you very much, Ian. Very, very nice of you to send them to us. And we've also got a couple of uh, super thanks as well there. Yeah, we've got John Salter. Thanks, John. Uh, and Mags K. Mags K from Scotland. Thanks very much, Mags. We know you enjoy the videos and we'll be going out there very shortly ourselves again. So uh, I bet it's cold up there. Oh, yeah. So, it's cold down here, eh? It's cold, it's cold down in here, here, Sharon. Well, yeah. We're going to be doing a few more little uh, vi uh, content, bit, bit slightly different content, folks. We did touch on this before, uh, that, like the cheaper meals, the budget meals and stuff like that. So we're going to be incorporating a few of them. But also on our travels as well, we understand that a lot of people have to buy supermarket food or processed food and stuff like that. So we're just gonna buy a few of the cheaper ones and just see what's on the market. That doesn't mean to say that we buy that and that's what we eat, but we do understand that there are a lot of you out there who do eat that sort of stuff and uh, through the convenience factor as well. And I know where else we're gonna go. Where? We're going to Marks and Spencer's because apparently oh, now- Sharon. They we're... have a value range. Well, yeah, so... but not only that, Sharon, what have we just found? It's the best. Now, I don't know whether you agree with us, folks, but English mustard over the years... Coleman's it used to be, it, didn't it? It used to be the one to get, Coleman's. Yeah. It's got tamer and tamer and tamer, to the extent now where English mustard really isn't English mustard anymore, known for being hot, Sharon. Yes. And we've been searching for a long, long time for a decent English mustard that gives you that bite, you know? That, them ones in the sachets are awful English mustard. Let's show you this one. This Look is the one. I found. I found it. And I'm going to buy a load. We are. This stuff, we got this from Marks and Spencer's Food, English mustard. Well, it just said mustard, hot English. Now, this stuff... It's like the powdered-tasted one when you make your own. I know we used to make the powdered ones. But that's hard to get. Yeah, we have at the top, but that's even hard to get at the moment now. We love the dried it. powder. We love it so much that we bought that one. You know, but look how far down the tin we are. Look, we're right down the bottom of the tin, look. But the ready-made stuff, you mix that stuff with water, didn't you? But this stuff... But you, you sniff that. Wait there, Shell, wait there. You sniff that and it affects you. Wait there, look. See, I'll go, I won't go that near, but... Put you, that there. Let oh, me get a knife. Can you have a pork pie, baby? Because I need this for the oh, cooking Sharon. video. 
I need these bits for the cooking. Oh, yesterday. do you? So, yeah. I'll put it back yeah. in, go on. There's just enough there for what I want. She's bought a couple of them little pork pies, folks. We're going on a little bit of a jaunt. Oh, that even smells up. And it's that lighter colour as well, folks. When you mix this stuff up, it comes out lighter than the stuff you get the ready-made stuff. Have right. I've got an old one? Have I not? I don't know. Before? I don't know, Sharon. I think we've got a couple of mini pork pies here, different. folks. Oh, Charlotte might have one in her. Now, stuff, for the record, oh, what's just that? I'll just have a look to see if Charlotte's got my. For the record, here. folks, we are not on the keto diet. We basically eat low carb, although when you see us cooking food, we have to eat it because it's in our videos and we can't just do keto recipes because that's not what our channel is about. It's about cooking food in our air fryers, in our other appliances, the ninjas, the, 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 um, the, uh, on the induction hob. But we have to taste the food that we cook, obviously, and we're cooking for you, not necessarily cooking what we always eat all the time. Although today, we have got little pork pies. I have them for my journeys, so I'm wearing the carbs. But we're predominantly low carb. We don't eat a lot of carbs, although we do eat the odd carb. I, I have to do it for my health benefits because I've got type 2 diabetes. So when you see me eat stuff, like someone mentioned in the um, the spam video, when we done the spam, spam in the roll, they said, uh, oh, so you're off the low carbs then? No, we predominantly eat low carbs, but if you actually watch that video, I only took one bite. And yeah, he doesn't have no bite. more. The dogs sometimes have it, all right. And we're having this now, literally, just because you're here, and we're going to be changing Thanks. this mushroom. Thanks. So she loves these. So let's just cut this pork pie, Sharon, in in in, in four I little bits. I love garlic pie. my favourite, though. Yeah, four little bits there. Look. Now, this mustard is fantastic. Watch how much she puts on. No, though. no. Even this, I've got to be careful with this, Sharon. Look, I'll put a quite. No. A bit, I do oh, put no, quite no, a bit no, on. No, no, no. That's right. too much. Go on, on you go. On you go. Get your bit. I'll just give a. This really does burn. It goes through it your, your goes through your nostrils and it gets to the back of my... I can feel it in my head, the brain. Mm. It's right, you've got to have mustard on a pork pie. Mm. But there again, something which was told to us, have them hot. They are just as nice hot, folks. Gives it a totally different texture. I've got to go in again, Cheryl. Oh, no, no. This time I'm going to put even more on. It didn't bite me that bit. It didn't bite me at all. Perhaps I need to put some more on. Does it need stirring? Maybe. Mm. But this is super. Oh, oh yeah, I've got it, Cheryl. I licked just the mustard. Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. I licked just the mustard. No way. Would I ever do that? Yeah. Put a little. So that's the one to have, folks. MS English mustard. Especially if you like a kick. We're specifically going back to Marks and Spencer's to buy that. And in fact, MS is Martin and Sharon's mustard, Sharon. Isn't it? Yep. So, but they are supposed to have a value range out, so yep. we're going to go around Marks and Spencer's and have a look at this value range and cook something with it. Mm. But we've actually been down to Heron Foods, which is just up the road from us. What's that road? Six miles, Sharon, isn't it? Mm. And they do a lot of two pound meals and stuff like that. So we've actually got a few of them in. So they'll be coming up because I know a lot of people who are struggling with money at the moment with this heating crisis and whatever. And we've actually kept our heating below last year again in this very, very cold weather. So it, the kilowatt hours is way, way down. And even the cost is below the threshold what we spent last year. So we're well happy with that. And as I say, it just means that we've got to wrap up a lot more. And uh, they're sitting there winking at me, so we're going to have to put them away. Otherwise There's we'll... nothing I like more than me roaring fire going. And I've had some coal, which I've been buying for a while, gave out no heat. So I've gone somewhere else to get coal today, and the difference. So who would have thought? It's not actually coal, it's that new stuff, isn't it? That sort of smokeless crap. Yeah, because you can't which buy It house... glows you and can't it heats buy up. buy house, house coal But no it doesn't more. get flame. it doesn't get flames off of it. But in the future, because a lot of that heat just goes up the chimney, so we'll be looking at the getting... Uh, a, a log burner that throws the heat out into our living room. You can put one of them fans on the top, can't you? Yeah, yeah so that's yeah. something else we're looking for. Anyway, thank you very much for watching, folks. I think we've rambled on for long enough in this little segment. Yeah, we do like a ramble, don't we? All you new subscribers out there, thank you very much, and thanks for watching all our previous and videos. Just some new people, please, because we sort of got stuck now. Yeah. I don't want to yeah, be stuck, we, I want to just keep we, going. We, we've, hit, we've, hit, we've hit a plateau. Yeah. We've, we're 53,000 at the moment. Yeah. And, uh, but don't get me wrong, we're really grateful at that. Yes, we are. And all you new people, thanks very much for watching our older videos as well. 
Anyway, we're going to go. We've got a little bit of a journey next week to show you. That'll be on next week's vlog. Don't Who forget. Who am I visiting for? Eight o'clock every Sunday where you can join in the chat box as well. So have a little binge watch of our videos, our foodie videos, and then have a look at our vlog videos. They're all in the playlist. He's you... here, people. He's here. Come in. Yeah, come out. Come on. Come on. Up. Murder, no. up. There he is. This is Mummy's baby. There he is. Look. Lot of somebody love no, somebody get away from that. thought last Sunday that he gets neglected. Believe me, this dog is ruined. He doesn't get neglected. None of my dogs get neglected. Anyway, get him down, shall you? Because that'll kick off another blinking out and safety yeah. thing. Anyway, thanks very much, folks. We'll see you in the next video. And until then, bye for now. Bye.